On Dirt Racing News here at the Brighton Speedway, getting ready for the Apple Fest shootout weekend. Dirt Car Sportsman running tonight, standing here with Brad Rails. Brad, top five in points coming into tonight. You're uh, in the thick of the hunt right now, but this track, a great equalizer. They don't run Dirt Car Sportsman at all throughout the season except for this one event, so it kind of opens up the door for everyone, doesn't it? Oh, for sure. It's uh, it's tough competition and everything, but uh, we ran here a couple years. We ran real solid. You just got to stay out of trouble and be there at the end pretty well. That's the hardest part here. Now, these Dirt Car Tour events, so tough to get a victory in. I mean, it's it's hard enough at a weekly track at Merrittville where the competition is so tight. Talk about how much more intense it is when you go to these tour races. Oh, it's really intense. You just keep... Uh it's like you got the best of the best and you just got to keep plugging away every spot's important since you're chasing the trail series right so you just got to take every spot as you can they head into this race obviously your points racing but you're going for the win and you're heading into the busiest part of the schedule super dirt week talk about what preparation is involved in getting a car ready to run the mile well we uh, there's a lot of preparation we uh, after this weekend we're off to RPM tomorrow night and then uh, this thing will be stripped right down to nothing regone we got a brand new body going on a couple new sponsors and uh, we borrowed a car uh, people offered us a car for Wii Sports, so that really makes it a lot easier now talk about uh, your weekly racing uh, on a weekend basis uh, co competition like I say so tough up there you got some young guns in at the top of the field but it, it's it's tricky on a weekly basis to find victory lane oh for sure it's um, I honestly think we got the toughest competition out of everybody. It's uh, not putting anybody down, but it, it's uh, every week you got about 10 cars that could win. And uh, the other fields are a little bit, I find a little bit weaker. You got about five guys, but it, it just keep running like up there and we just keep plugging away and try to stay out of trouble. Now it takes a lot of good crew, sponsors to get you to the track. Who would you like to thank? Oh, I'd like to thank my crew. I got Dave, Kenny, Brent. And uh, I'd like to thank my sponsors. I got uh, picked up St. Amon Auto. Uh, that's helped me out for Syracuse with the body and everything. And uh, it's just uh, every, everybody helps all Ontario truck driving schools really help me out with fuel wise and that. So it, it helps. There you go. That's Brad Rose. He'll be one to watch here tonight at the Brighton Speedway. I'm Greg Kellen, and we got you covered on dirt.